Hello, friends. If you're watching this, then it means I've survived another floor of the Tower of Vaporum. I don't know what to expect today. After the encounters last time with all those robots and that bug, I can only imagine what we've got to deal with today. My suit is telling me we're in the waterworks. But what this means, me I do not know. Uh. Ha! Only one can attack me now! Uh. Uh. Fuck! I didn't realize you could fly! Well, I knew you could fly, but I didn't think- it I didn't think to think that that would mean you could get me. Let's just read what we got here. I really miss my buddy Adam. That dude had one messed up sense of humor. Got fired up, got fired over some naughty pictures or something. Now the new kid, he is one sh one hell of a workhorse, but he seriously needs to light it up. Have some fun, man. He just keeps him keeps himself to himself all the goddamn time. Winnie Bench. Hmm. Isn't that the philosophy that a worker should have, Benny? Right. I hear one of the flying things. Well, that's not fair. Die! Thank you. Took you long enough. What have you got in the box? A mace and a sword. Ooh. What's that? a family gun? I found a hidden corridor, a perfect place to hide my precious spacer. There's a strict ban on guns here in the Ark for us commoners, but there's no, but nobody's gonna take a gun. A gun gun of my be veteran. My dad gave it to me, and his dad gave it to him, all the way back to the great-great-granddaddy. We veterans take care of ourselves. If only we hadn't bent the screw on the, bre the wall brace. Just hope nobody notices. Hmm. Well... You seem like a nice gun. What type of gun are you? One hand unique gun. Bullets piss through enemies, dealing all damage to a lie behind them. Ooh. Hmm. Quite a short cooldown. Shorter cooldown than the, la than the last gun. But only a bit more bit, bit more damage. Well, think about it. Right. And there is literally no difference between the sword and the mace. Okay. I guess that just determines what you're... That's dependent on what you're trained in. I thought I saw something. Die. Die. You're not gonna beat me today, little robot. You're only a robot. I need a key. That was kind of close. Very close indeed it was myself. But I'm sure it's perfectly fine. There it closes behind us again. Let's just, just get this key and use it there. Okay, I just heard something. I think there's more than one. That one has a gun. I'm sure it does. Die, robot, die! Get shocked, robot! 
And thank you for the ammo. I need to start using that. Because I've got plenty of the stuff. Holy... Where... What is this place? Uh, maybe there's a way to raise the water level. Hmm, maybe indeed. But looking at the stuff down there, I don't think I want to. Oh good, you don't let me walk... I don't walk off the edge myself. Hello? Okay, I'm sure we can do this in a very fun way. That hurts, you prick! Thank you for dying. Come on! Bitch! Not dealing with me, you're not! Thank you for the ammo! I don't think I want to step on that yet. And I can't go that way. I guess I have to stand on the little pushy pad. Whatever the pushy pad is gonna do. Well, hopefully not do that, so I could actually just go... Or if that happens just because I'm sta- no, it's permanent now. Okay, there's something over here. Die? Die! Die, robot! Die! Stupid little spider drone! A brick. Why do I need a brick? I need a key. A golden key, you say? Alright then, well, we're gonna keep- put that there, just in case. You can drop any ob item you find obsolete onto the ground. You can throw items in onto the distance. Okay, we'll take the brick, again. No. Come on. Forward, forward. Well... Die, little robot! I do not give you permission to live! Right. Let's throw this brick this time. What do I mean this turn? This is the first time. There's no way I could, like, go back in time or anything. Ha 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 ha. So... Let's throw this brick to hit the... Let's throw this brick to hit the thing! Let's throw this brick to hit the thing! There we go! That took me over here. What's in here? First we have a golden key, which we needed. A soulmate. My my foreman, Mr. Bench. See, seems like a decent fella. He has a good sense of humor and all that. But I can't let him get too close to me. Can't let anybody get too close to me. Not after losing my soulmate, Lisa. She was so bright and warm. Only she got her nose too deep in the fu Furium research. I did warn her, but she, didn't li she wouldn't listen. So now, I've dedicated myself to work. Work and nothing else keeps me occupied when keep and keeps the blues at bay. Aw, poor guy. 
Today is the most beautiful day in my life. I found out that I'm pregnant. Marcus and I will have a baby. But Aww. still, raising a child here in the tower, I'm not sure how I feel about that. Yeah, that's understandable have to protect looking it at this from the tower. Of the, Fumium. the thing is, I'm starting to doubt that we really know anything about its power or influence. I'm pretty sure, though, that if it proves to be dangerous to the baby, Marcus and I will go back to the capital island. We'll be a family, and that's much more important than any research or benefits from the Bureau. Right, this Furium has side effects. That is good to know, I suppose. A helmet would do me wonders. Thank you very much. And your gloves are kind of sucky. Compared to what I have. You were the golden key, weren't you? Key. Yes, yes you were. Fuck! Eat sword! Bug? Seriously, how is there a bug that big in this place? Seems just awfully weird. Right. Do we want to... I don't see that did anything. I don't think that did anything. Is the door gonna close? It don't look it. Huh. It doesn't appear to be anything over here. Ooh, what are you? Unleash a wave of fire in dealing damage dealing damage to enemies hit by the administering flame burning on them. Burning da burning deals damage over time, both primarily to the target and the targets around it. Burning effect. When burning burning the target and nearby the, and their nearby enemies will take some damage over time. Enemies capable of causing burning are resistant to all burning effects themselves. You wouldn't have thought, would you? That they'd be immune to the thing they can do. We discovered cockroaches here in Arx Vaporum. They must have found their way in here with the supplies of fruit and veg. We quickly decided to eradicate them, but Laura stepped in with the bold idea. Let's use them for research. We feed Furium enhanced fruit hash to these pesky little to these little pesky creatures. Well, little. They're gr they are growing fast. We are. We had to build holding cells for them as they started to lash out at us. Very agile, quick, and hard to contain. I just hope these roaches don't become strong enough to break out their cells. Observing their growth and behavior is marvelous. But there are risks we cannot foresee, I'm afraid. So... Okay, that's a little pointless, given the fact that it's a... Is that all? Yeah. Right. So. Ah. Hmm. Okay, we're over here. We can't get back. Oh goody. Who know? Oh, bloody. That wasn't nice. Get shocked, you stupid little cockroach thing. Oh! 
Thank you, suit. You've self-repaired yourself. I'm good with this. So, translation, that means I, you know, gain more experience? Alright, we know which route we're taking. I am a technician after all, I should be... Can't use that, okay. Hmm. I don't trust that there isn't... If I pull that lever, something is going to come out and get me. What are you... Oh. Another gadget. Well then. Last item? Acid Roach. Although the population of roaches did not originally possess any form of acidic attack, some have now developed a strong spitting mechanism inside their mandibles. Oh goody! This is what you get with biological mutations. The ball of spit tends to burst into an acidic pool on impact, very toxic with possible long-lasting effects on health. I believe this has something to do with the diet, as we feed each group a different variant of durian-based food. I'll need to get a more statistical data to be sure. When splashed by an acid attack, the target's health and re repairing capabilities are greatly reduced, and they and they take some damage over time. Over a short period of time, time capable en enemies capable of sp spraying acid are resistant to all acid effects themselves. And what are you, my friend? Gain a massive boost to resistance, taking less damage from bleeding, shock, acid, and fire. Hmm. 30 second duration. That's quite a long time. I think I'll take you and replace you for the fire. Because everyone knows lightning is always better than fire. Huh. Oh, no. No, open this door, not the other door. Oh, we're back at the start. Huh. Then... Oh, this ju I can just open. Oh, and you close behind you. Well... I guess that's me out rising the water level a little. Way there. There's so many ways to... How can you live in a place like this? It's a freaking maze! Oh, you can only be good, can't you, little pad? Okay. This seems pretty easy to deal with right now. Oh great, it's a gun one. Screw your gun! Who needs it? My gun is better! What are we going here then? Lots of ammo! Thank you! With the amount of ammo I use on killing you. Okay, so I need a brick or something probably to get on that one. What's this? Basic- oh, you're the one I have. Alright then. Crude Warhammer. Hmm. Hunter Shotgun. Hmm. Okay, let's see what the the diagraph has to say. Such fond memories of my study years. The Bureau had granted me a scholarship, which I gladly repaid by pledging to work in the Arxvaporum for a seven-year term. My dreams came true. When I first arrived on Capital Island, coming from my home at Garion Islet, the astonishing sight of the labs, workshops, and all the machinery took me by storm. 
It was like Christmas trees covered with shiny cogs instead of balls and ornaments. It was heaven. Lots of folks grumble at the Bureau nowadays for silencing the critics and abusing power, supposedly. In my eyes, the Bureau is doing it right. Technology, order, and science should all be at the heart of society. I am where I am today, amidst the pioneers of the world, only thanks to the Supreme Bureau. Huh. What a nerd. To be fair, to be fair myself, he's not wrong. That went too far. Come on! Alright, Brick, you're starting to annoy me. do that. Yeah, that's how you we do it. Right. I have to do the same thing again. Or not. I'm just gonna go in. He's coming for me. I can tell this. Get shocked. That's right, you lose. Right, what does this do? Gain precision with ranged weapons for a short period of time. I assume that basically means I get super aiming. Okay. And then you're just a gun. What I already even have. I wonder if I'm going to be able to melt down these guns or something. Alright, clearly this does something. Holy! This is how we do it. Aha! Your guns are nothing to me. Screw your sentry turrets. They're kind of pathetic. They can't shoot in diagonal lines. Maybe this universe doesn't know what a diagonal line is. Hello, chest. You contain a crude mace. Like the one we already had. And bullets. Nice bullets. There's the water. The bridge should be safe to cross now. Come on. Come on me. Move it. Okay, I need some string or something like it to tie the pieces together. Aha! Or rope. Clever thinking me. Whatever would I do without do myself? What's in this chest? Bullets and a thing. We have arrived. We have arrived. Finally, our new home here at the Arch Vaporum. I'm impressed by what the Bureau has accomplished. It's gargantuan. Can't wait to unpack and start working. Being stranded here in the middle of the ocean like this worries me a little, but the tower feels strong and safe. I need a key. I'm pretty sure no Kenyut will repeat ever again. The research on the Fumio Wait, was what's kind of this? Maybe I'm dreaming here, but it could just happen to be the next marvel of the world, and we'll be right in the thick of things. I'm so looking forward to taking over and continuing the project, and the best thing about it is the fusion of family and working life combined together. Eat sword! <sighs> Stupid thing.
Excuse you? Is this death trap of a place? All right, monograph. What do you have to say? Another great success. Today, the local coordinator for the bureau and chief officer of the Arcs, Marcus Reich, appointed me deputy foreman of manufacturing. I'll take care of workshops, maintenance, and manufacturing itself. I'm so proud that Mr. Reich recognized my accomplishments. He's a role model. Not only is he an experienced scientist and a veteran of the island wars against the rebels, he's also the ideal man for the job. An excellent choice by the Bureau to lead the project. He and his wife Laura are the perfect model of how I picture my life in the future. Well, good on you, mate. I hope you found that, that life of yours. No going back now. Ha! I win. Damn cockroach. All is good. We found our way. We've got on our things. Open the gate. Don't do anything that might get me killed any further. I'm really hoping there's nothing left in here. This is bad. Uh, hello, man. Can we talk about this? I suppose not. Uh, you seem like a perfectly reasonable chap. Are you sure we can't talk about this? I had a feeling you'd do that. Ow! Ow! Come on, pal! Be reasonable! I mean you no harm! I'm shooting you because you're sh because you're trying to kill me and you're being a prick! Same reason I kill everyone! Because they're pricks! See? That wasn't so bad, now was it? A golden key. Um, what? Well, things just suddenly took a... Oh. Uh, now. We can o obviously only expect smiles and cheers from this. Hear, hear this on out. Oh, this is bad. I am boxed in a corner. I am. I'm getting the strangest sense of deja vu right now, as if I've gone through the down this path like twice before already. I wonder why that is. Oh, no, this is bad. You are a very strange man with what you're trying to kill me and all that. There is no reason to do that. I wish I could hit with this damn gun. There we go, just like that. Now I have a key, and I need to heal. And there we go. There's no way that was human. Or was it? I'm not sure of anything now. Well, I honestly think it was human. Maybe, but not anymore. Personally. I think it was a robot. Okay, and we ascend to the next floor. Excellent. Good for us. Well, every- 
well follow people in this weird place. I'm going to leave haunted. This can only be good. It really didn't seem that human. There was flesh, yeah, but there was steel and whatever that blue stuff was. This place just feels so familiar, but none of the vermin and scrap meat tin men do. Well, I'm gonna leave this video here. If you've watched it, I thank you for wa watching, and I, I hope you can make it through the next floor. And if you see a video at the ne end of the next floor, know that I survived. But if you don't, know that I died fighting. But until I see you again, I'm gonna have to bid thee farewell. Good day, and hopefully a good night.